everyone in today's video i want to take these drab christmas ornaments and i want to kind of jazz them up and paint them so they look more realistic i guess i got these i think it was a pack of 28 from walmart and it was around ten dollars for anyone who's seen my previous video where i made a gingerbread christmas tree skirt these are going on the same tree so let's get started my idea for this is the metallic-y looking ones, I definitely want to paint a light brown so it kind of has more of a gingerbread feel to it. And I'm going to keep the glitter ones as is, but I will paint the scarves and the face just so they stand out more. I'm using your basic acrylic paints from Walmart and Target. They range around from 50 cents to I think around a dollar depending if they're like matte or glossy. So definitely not expensive by any means. For all the paint, I'll be doing two layers for a better coverage. And even though you're watching me decorate like four ornaments, I'll be decorating all 28 ornaments off camera. So toward the end, I'll definitely insert photos of all the decorated ornaments. And then we'll check out the final gingerbread Christmas tree because it'll be completed. If you decorate for the holidays, let me know in the comments how you do so. Like, is there a theme to it, a color or anything like that? I am all about Christmas everything. And I know I've mentioned in a previous video that I don't decorate for outside. But I can proudly say that this year I decorated outside with Christmas lights and that's because I invested into solar lights so they don't need an outlet to be plugged into so I don't have to worry about like the cables going over the lawn and then when it comes to cutting the lawn and stuff because being in South Florida we don't get a winter so our grass doesn't stop growing or die off in the winter time. So I just kind of got overwhelmed with the logistics of that. Like if the grass is growing and then I have the decorations there and you go around them and then these extension cords, but the outdoor outlet doesn't work. So you got to put the cord underneath your front door and slam it real hard. So that way you can get power. Needless to say, for some reason, solar lights came into my mind this year and it's so much easier. I just wrap it around a palm tree and I stick the little solar stake in the ground, face it toward the sun and the light goes on at nighttime and turns itself off during the daytime just to be recharged, so on and so forth. And with that, my rant is officially over. So what's one Christmas tradition that you either still do to this day or used to do as a kid that you absolutely love? For me, it would have to be the tradition when I was growing up in New York that the volunteer firefighters would come out and do a route in their fire engines, fire vehicles, fire trucks, and they would all be decorated with Christmas lights. They'd have Christmas music going. They'd be honking their horns, sirens going, and it was such a spectacle to watch and it felt so magical and the very last engine would have santa you know ho 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 they would throw out candy canes i love that christmas tradition where i live now they made it seem like they were doing something similar to that effect they called it a drive-by santa and I was excited for it. I had high expectations. Needless to say, long story short, it was a couple of older teenagers in a white pickup truck, threw Santa in the back of that pickup truck. And by the time I took out my phone, man, they flew by. I, they were well over the speed limit. It's so funny. If I find the video, I'll definitely insert it into the clip so you can see it. Hi, Santa. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Yeah, I just can't believe it. But on a positive note, here is my gingerbread Christmas tree. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. There is the tree skirt I made and I did put fake snow on top, but it's removable just, just because. But all right guys, well, that's it for my video today. If you want, feel free to like and subscribe and until next time, bye friends.